Hello all and welcome to another episode of Everyday Black History. Now today on Everyday Black History, we're going to be highlighting a man, a brother by the name of Dr. Mark Dean. And Dr. Mark Dean is an African-American inventor and computer engineer. He was part of the team that developed the ISA bus, which allows for multiple uh, modems and routers to be connected to the computer. And he also led a design team that uh, created the one gigahertz computer processing chip. He holds three of nine PC patents for being the co-creator of the IBM personal computer, which was released in 1981. Now, just a little background uh, information on him. Uh, he was born uh, in Jefferson City, uh, Tennessee, March uh, 2nd, 1957. And even at a young age, he displayed an affinity for technology and invention. It is uh, said that him and his father uh, constructed a tractor from scratch. And if you've ever seen a tractor, you can see, you know, you see how big they are. It's a pretty complex piece of machinery. No matter how big or small it is, it's still a pretty complex piece of machinery for a child to build along with his father. Now, uh, he was educated at uh, the University of Tennessee, you know, where he received his bachelor's degree in electrical engineering. He received his master's degree in electrical engineering from Florida Atlantic University and a PhD in electrical engineering at Stanford University. He is the first African American to become an IBM fellow, which is the highest level of technical excellence at the company. And in the late 90s, in 1997, he was inducted into the National Inventors Hall of Fame. Uh, he is uh, the currently he's the interim dean at the Tiku College of Engineering and is the John Fisher Distinguished uh, Professor in the Department of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science at the University of Tennessee. He was previously the CTO for IBM Middle East and Africa and was an IBM Vice President overseeing the company's uh, Almaden Research Center in San Jose, California prior to that. He now holds more than 20 patents and he was part of the team, as mentioned earlier, that developed the interior architecture, the ISA systems bus, which enables for multiple devices to be connected to personal computers. So imagine that, you know, a black man was instrumental in the creation of the personal computer. And many people don't know that. You know, IBM uh, during that time was one of the, um, you know, major computer outlets. I mean, uh, computers had to be IBM compatible. The only one that uh, wasn't IBM compatible was Apple. But just to show how, um, how important, you know, IBM was to the advancement of computers and a black man was a part of that. So we wanted to highlight his uh, contribution to not only computers and how it changed our way of life today, but it's important that it that we highlight it for uh, black history and for its contributions to black history, because uh, who knew that a black man was, was partially responsible for this? He played a part in helping this to go forward. So, Dr. Mark Dean, we thank you for your contribution in, um, to black history and black culture, and we salute you for it. Now that concludes this episode of Everyday Black History. Tune in as we'll be talking more people and institutions, black men and women who contributed to uh, black history and black culture. So stay tuned.